to Suladan place, Star Wars, Knights of the Old Republic 2. Last time we cleared this place of all who inhabit it. Um, I know the ventilation controls are over there, but I kind of want to see what happens if I try to leave through the other door. Because there was another door. Not the one that led to the tunnels, but that just led to, like, exit. I don't know if the game's actually going to let me do that, but let's try it. Escape tunnel. Access escape routes. Yak yeah, yak yeah, and leave. What happens if leave? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well that's apparently doing a thing. That's doing a bad thing. So let's not do that. Okay, so that did a bad. Let's see what happens if we do the ventilation control. Uh, system commands. Oh, that's right. It does nothing. I mean, security doors. I don't think that's the... I don't think that's how that works. I mean, I don't think that opens this door. High security door. Okay, so yeah, the thing that we had done was the done was the the correct thing. Never mind. I thought the game was giving me the option to like just leave and abandon the Jedi or to uh, open the things. So yeah, apparently not. Okay. I mean, I guess that makes sense. But it also confuses me. I figured it was giving me like a distinct light side, dark side choice of like, abandon him, but he survives anyway because magic Jedi stuff. And, uh, save him, and he survives anyway because magic Jedi stuff. Uh, anyway, escape tunnel. Escape tunnel. I hear an awful lot of thumping and whooping going on in them walls. Maybe that is the Jedi. Anyway, activate the escape route. Already cleared this place out anyway. So, uh, cutscene! Yeah, the alarm! Who opened the door to the vent tunnels early? I ordered it sealed until I gave the command! How could the Jedi have opened it from the ins- Mira! Ah, looks like the hunter's trying to escape. I'll just send some men to take care of her. Lock her. Anywhere. Just make sure she doesn't escape again. Deploy more of the clan to cover the base. We will need all of them. I can't skip that one for some reason. And tell them I no longer care if the Jedi lives or dies. Some of them you can click through to progress, and some of them you can't. It's weird, and it seems random. Also, Jedi! If I hadn't had a lightsaber equipped, that would have been a whole lot less impressive. Also still loving this armor. Not present here, your map is recalibrated. Okay, game, that is exactly what we're gonna do. Back through the tunnels. Got it. Tunnels are still poisonous. Okay, tunnels are no longer poisonous. Dee -dee -dee. I mean, the game basically just told me, hey, you should go back. You should loot all the mines that I forgot there were mines back here, but the game, you know, the game, the game knew, the game warned me, told me, encouraged me. Who is Booyan? Are you another one that died in here? First the map goes static, then I hit a frag charge tearing my leg apart. Who placed mines down here? Hera must have set me up. That or somebody else is protecting something down here. If I could still walk, I could gather the mines, use their beacons to leave a trail out, but uh, there's not much chance of that. Looks like Vaga isn't going to get his spice after all. They'll break down into their chemical components in an hour in these fumes. Okay. I'm going to go this way. Mine. Mine. still like that how you can, you know, see them through the floor because the floor is transparent. Mine. So it's just a grid of rooms full of mines and poison. Mine. 
That door is open and there's a mine. I'm confused by that. Surely you're not implying that I left mines, that I just walked past them. How dare anyone imply that. I don't know, that door may have just been opened by, by default. You're just gonna have to wait for me to grid my way through this place. Okay, that door leads to this exit, so we're gonna go to this one now. It's kind of stair-step shaped. I think this is the path we ended up taking, almost. I, I followed the outer edge, basically. Okay, so we've been everywhere down here. I could just leave. Probably not, but... Okay, yep. I figured it was sealed. There's no way the game would just let me leave. Because that would kind of break the plot. But, I mean, it was worth a try. Also fast. Do, 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 do. Won't make the doors open any quicker. In fact, it seems to make them slower. Because I misclicked. Okay. Anybody in here? Go ahead. Put some barriers up. Oh, hi. I don't have to fear y'all. For I am the fast! I don't know who I hit. Okay, I thought that was me for a second. Yeah, y'all are dead. Y'all are dead. And the fast wore off. The fast wore off! Abort mission! Use the fast! Fast. There you go. Find more! I need more. Where are they? Give me more stuff to fight. I can actually win fights now. I should probably heal. I'm gonna cycle through those. It's a little bit tedious at times. Nobody in here. Really? Is three of them all you set loose? Well, that's sad, but okay. I'll just go this way. Oh, I don't want to fight anybody anyway. Hmm. I guess we'll just open the tunnel. Even though it was presumably already open. Someone's activated at the door. In doing so, it opened the door to the vent tunnel where I escaped. Okay. I can't go here. Is, is but, but I'm just gonna wander around then. Surely Mira's hanging out somewhere. Great. Need to get out of here before Visquis executes me. Oh, she got caught. I'm confused. You need to choose one party member to accompany Atten and Bowder. No one Atten does not need a third party member. HK, you, you know what you must do. Uh, he swallowed remote. Why did we just switch? Okay, now we're back over here. I like what the game's trying to do and it's trying to show like, you know, you having a movie where it's like, meanwhile, this is happening. Meanwhile, this is happening. It's kind of jarring in the gameplay, though. I'm really glad that Atten has learned how to do things. Sadly, Atten doesn't have a lightsaber. Atten, you do have a lightsaber. Oh, it's just not. Throw the lightsaber! Wait, do you have stun? You do not. Throw the lightsaber! Bowder, uh, you just go do hand-to-hand -hand stuff, and HK, don't turn around at me. Fire! I, I said throw the lightsaber. I said throw the lightsaber. Throw it! Throw it! Aha! I don't know what happened. I don't need to know what happened. All these fools dead. 
And the game let me loot them this time, which is, you know, a huge benefit. Atten has the fast, but he is also wearing armor, and I just, uh... That dexterity bonus is just painful to give up. Plus six. <laughs> Bowder cannot. Sure, we'll put you in that. Hatton, what have I done to you? Plus seven. I'm not gonna question these things. Atten can go the fast. Hi, Gan. Atten is the fast. Have you met him? Oh my dear goodness. Atten, what have you become? Powerful, powerful is what you have become. Well, okay. Also, that place is closed. I don't know why they closed. I can't go in. They closed. I can't even click on the door. They so closed. I can't. It, it won't even tell me the door's locked. It's just closed. It's just like, nope. Also, random, but the fact that all of this map is recovered makes me suspect that this is actually a separate location in the game's code that just looks identical to the other. But I can't be sure about that. Uh, whatever the case, at least the map system is viewing it as separate. loot. Nope, stain. Don't need to loot the stain. Yo, Zugs! Y'all think you can shoot Atten? Y'all think you can shoot Atten? Atten, take all y'all down before you can shoot? Let's settle this. Atten, you, you terrify me, but not in a bad way. You're, you're gonna be a very good party member. HK-47, I have somehow produced an assassin out of that. I don't know how I did it, but I'm sure you're proud of me. Now, if only the fast would stop wearing off. Hi, Gand. This is a really nice, like, freeze frame right here. Just Atten going on a rampage in a Jedi robe. Not where I expected my day to go, but, you know, why not? Go for it! Get him! These Gand are actually putting up a fight. Not for long. But they did put up a fight. I mean, I did say I wanted a fight, so I mean, I guess the game gave me what I was looking for. At least poor Gand. I don't know why they're just hanging out over here in a corner, because I can't even do anything there. And this is the direction that, yes, that I can go. I was about to say, this is the direction that the Jug Jug Tar is in. And now we're back here. That was a happy little rampage. Um. Don't mind me, I'm just standing over here. Putting uh, buffs into effect. Is he gonna talk? I'm suspicious of using you have finally arrived, both much sooner, yet much later than I'd hoped. I'm a paradox like that. You're the one that wanted to see me, so what did you want? Very well. Let us dispense with the pleasantries. You are, after all, human. Based on your actions alone, I take it you are not familiar with the organization I serve, or my responsibilities. I mean, okay. I run the refugee sector. I decide what happens here. I control the flows and events of the currents of the sector. I mean, I wiped out the your your whole force in the refugee sector. You were there. You have caused a great deal of trouble for the exchange here on Nar Shada, and I want to know why. Hmm. Hmm. I kind of want to, one and five are both valid kind of queries here. Well, one's not a question. 
So why don't you tell me why you're squeezing the life out of the refugee sector? We sought to put pressure on the refugee sector for a simple reason. Whenever seeming innocents are placed in danger, especially human fodder, there the Jedi are, lightsabers blazing. It's curious though, we've been applying pressure on the humans in the sector for some time, yet only now do you show yourself. Uh, I only just got here. Ah, the Jedi have always been slow to act when danger threatens. More so now than in the past, and you are no different. Still, if you were only a recent arrival, that would lend some validity to the rumors of another Jedi being here on Nar Shadda. Fortunately for me, I just needed one. Uh, so why'd you put a bounty on me? Oh, you mistake me. I was not the one who put the bounty on you. We all have our masters, you know. My soon-to-be-deceased boss, Goto, is the one who placed the monumental sum of credits upon your head. Your price is so high that any bounty hunter who captures you will be able to buy their own planet! You must have angered Goto greatly for him to hunt you so. And that's why you're the perfect bait, and why I will bring you to Bota, Goto, and then I will kill him! I knew I should have put the bubble up. The gas! It isn't... You! Eh! How are you all? Attack the Jedi! Did I just put my lightsaber away? You all! Attack the... You all! You, you never truly worked for me! While the Jedi remains on Nar Shaddaa, my eyes shall watch him. Goto! I, I didn't! I wasn't! Please, take the Jedi! I offer the human as a gift, freely, as I would my own life! Enough. Leave him be! Ah, too late. What an amusing Jedi specimen you are. Ow! I need to stop walking into Tesla cages. Tesla coils. Somehow I've combined a Tesla cage, a Faraday cage and a Tesla coil, and I've created a horrifying contraption in my mind. Glad somebody arrived. Saves me the trouble of having to break out of here. Also known as just using the wrong words at the wrong time and combining concepts by mistake. And you are... Name's Mira. I've been watching you all stumble around this moon for a while, causing trouble. But now you've got Goto's attention, and he's the last person you want to have watching you. And why, how'd Viscus capture you? Ugh, I was taken down like an amateur. I've never been inside the Jek Jek Tar, but they won't catch me the same way twice. You may have defeated Viscus, but you won't take down Goto so easily. And now he's the one who has your friend. Hmm. You took my main character away, and I'm sad. Well, HK, you are now my main character. We can deal with that once we're out of here and someplace safe. Come on, I know one place where they won't find us. Karth is being very quiet, and I got light side points for doing absolutely nothing. I mean, it works, I guess. I didn't see who was on the other side of that door. I was too busy looking elsewhere. Ah, poor Viscus. We knew him not well. I didn't know Hanhar very well either, but, you know. Oh, hi, Greya. Why am I not surprised you wandered in here randomly? Awaken, beast. And Kraya can raise the dead. Hmm. What have you done? I have saved your life, beast. That makes it mine. I, I don't understand why I just heard metal. Neil. Why? Why do you do this? Why do you not let me die? Because I need you to hunt, beast. This prey is something you have chased all your life. You are born and bred to it like no predator before you. You want me to hunt the human Jedi? The exile? And kill? No, that you shall not do. You will not bring harm to the exile, and if you do, beast, I shall break you. The screams of your tribe of primitives, the scene of lying blinded with the huntress's blaster at your skull, I shall make it so that is all you hear and see for the rest of your days. Even your madness will not save you if you bring harm to the exile. Know this. Kill me. 
I cannot bear the weight of another life debt. Kill me or I swear I will kill you. Oh, the life debts of your people, the life debt you have twisted with your hate, I felt it within you. I shall promise you this, beast. Unlike the red-maned Huntress, as long as you are loyal, I shall never show you mercy, no pity. But most of all, I promise you an end to your debt. Hunt her, pursue her, kill her, and ending her life will end your debt to me. The pain will pass. I was able to heal some of the wounds, but the rest must remain. You will need that pain when you travel, and it will give you strength for the hunt to come. Where? Where can I find Mira? But first, I, I must okay, prepare you, you for what is to come. Skipped over something. Why does... Okay, I am confused and so many things are happening, and I don't know... Uh, we took out Viscous, but Hold Goto on. has him, and that means no bounty for me. Uh, so how do we get him back? There's no way to get him back. No one knows how to reach Goto except Viscous. And that squid head died in the Jack Jack Tar. The only way to reach Goto is if we had a Jedi. But now, he's got your friend. He doesn't have anybody else he wants captured. Mm. How does Goto hide his ship, then? He's got a cloaking device. He's the one that arranges the meetings on his ship, and until then, he can't be found. Trust me, if anyone knew how to track his ship, he'd have every bounty hunter and criminal on Nar Shaddaa gunning for it. I mean, I knew a guy that was hunting for a signal at some point, but I think he did, so maybe that was the signal. Maybe it was the thing coming off the droid in the Bazak den. Who knows? There must be a way. I say we hit orbit. If you were hunting for Godo's yacht, your freighter would be flying blind. Well, unless it was one of Voga the Hut's cargo ships. Then it would be snapped up by Godo pretty quick. A ding. What does Godo want with the freighters? Godo's been preying on Vaga's freighters for a while now. It's the reason Vaga's had to haul his bulk up here to Nar Shaddaa from Nel Hutta. Even with all the traffic around Nar Shaddaa, Godo seems to always know which ones are Vaga's, and his ship just snaps them up. How could he know that? Probably does it by tracking their transponder codes, but no one knows how he's getting them. So if we get one of Vaga's transponder cones, Godo's ship might come to us. I guess. You'd need to get the codes first, then retrofit your ship so it had the right transponder signal. Problem is, Vogus shut down the droid warehouse until he can find out who's been leaking the codes. You'd have to be a droid to get in there. OHK. Oh. I have a new droid for Vaga. 2,000 credits. Before I accept this, I must ask you how you acquired this particular droid. I am champ. I win it in the Zack match. I see. There should be no problem. Then in the credits will be transferred to your account as usual. Good. How I do? You're welcome. Good luck with your plan, little droid. You're the most adorable little NPC. Let's get you to work. Report to C7E3 for assignment. How many times have we changed characters in this one episode alone? We went from Mira to the Jedi to Atten. Back to the Jedi. Back to Atten. To T3. Somehow our little friend got involved and I'm a go in circles now. Whee! You are not authorized to leave the warehouse. Please report to your post. I wasn't trying to leave, I was trying to go in circles, but apparently I'm not fast enough. Please enter the warehouse. Okay, well you're not gonna say nothing interesting. Warehouse. Yo, buddy. Looks like you you made for moving boxes. He busy. He busy dancing. I don't know why he dancing, but he dancing. I don't trust you. Hey, lots of y'all in here dancing. That's why no work's getting done. Y'all just in here dancing. Can I loot these? Hello. Heavy armor, you say? Fox. Y'all didn't see a thing. Who are you? I certainly hope that rude C7 unit didn't send you over here. Those more recent models have no etiquette programming whatsoever. 
Date, date. I think he should be replaced or shipped down to maintenance to direct droids there. But I cannot seem to convince my masters of the logic of the request. Vreet. Oh, I wouldn't go that far, despite what others would say. A number designation for a C7 unit means far more than an integer increase. Hmm. Some droids undergo radical changes with each generation. Each numeric jump in sequence can have wide-ranging changes in functionality and temperament. But then, you are a new model yourself. I wouldn't expect you to understand how it feels. Now, was there something I could help you with? Deed. I see. Well, good day to you then. Ah, uh, was there anything to loot over here? This area is restricted. Please return to your designated area. Uh -huh. Please excuse my companion. He is easily excitable and takes our duty very seriously. In the hopes of avoiding an incident, I ask you to please return to your post. Door? I'm sorry. I don't believe I know what you are referring to. You must be mistaken. There is nothing of the sort. Now please, move along. Lying to you? But that would go against my programming. Please, as I said, you should return to your post. Now, now, T1N1. He is right about your size. Being touchy about it won't change anything. Really? You're much too sensitive about these things. Oh my, this is what I was afraid of. You have made him angry. I don't know where y'all are. I'm so confused. I just came over here to loot a box, apparently. Did I break the game somehow? The game clearly thinks I was somewhere that I wasn't. So we're just gonna be confused by that and go talk to this guy. I am sorry, but only authorized cargo droids are allowed into the warehouse. I cannot permit you to enter due to the sensitive cargo. Gag? No. In fact, I do not have you on my list of Coden's acquisitions. How did you get in here? Uh, Coden? I see. Well, I have no current use for you. I'll assign you to C6E3. He needs the help to make up for his inferior programming. I see. Persuade! If you do not wish to comply with these instructions, I can have you given a memory wipe and behavioral reprogramming. Good. Now report to C6E3. You will be assisting him. Have we ever leveled you up? I'm just gonna go with intelligence, skills. You have a very low persuade ability. But you're going to be very aware. You're going to have the highest awareness of any droid that ever droided. Um. Bear in mind, I have no idea what I'm doing. What is this? Proof caution. Dual strike. Demolitions. Uh, extra health, sure. There we go, now they're all at 14. You are a very aware little droid. Do loop. Do loop. I guess that's when I was supposed to come talk to this Oh, you're guy. back. What can I do for you? Uh, apparently I got demoted. That C7 droid absolutely infuriates me. Needs help to do my job, do I? Hmm. I would be happy to help you, but as long as that C7 unit is perched at the door, I can't. Well, 
If the C7 unit were to be disabled, my programming would require me to take over his responsibilities in his absence. I see. Yes, I would be willing to give you access to the next room. I see. Let's go back over here and see if those strange other droids that don't exist say anything. I'm very puzzled by them. Now, as for what we're going to do with this guy, I don't know. I'm going to go ahead and pause here, though. Thank you for watching. And next time, we're going to get rid of him. I don't know how we're going to do it, but we're going to do it. It may involve putting him inside of one of the boxes that we recently emptied out. But in any case, see you next time.